man, you're a poor budget and nugget of the internet RPG world. Uh, we're on session 11, I'm your DM, JBD. I'm Evan the Great, uh, from the Villain of the Man, playing Looter Silverstring. Who is uh, stupid and a murderer. I'm stupid, a murderer, and I have the murder weapon. Yeah, no, you don't have that anymore, it's gone. <laughs> I'm the Bearded Wonder with the Villains of Man, and I am playing Vesper Norik, the Moon Elf. I am Smiley, I am playing Ord Whitehammer, the Dwarf. I'm Roland Ivor, playing Roland Ivor. Ivor. <laughs> okay. So, um, Buddha, how about you uh, give us a little wrap up of the last uh, session? Uh, sure. Right after we have it. Uh, pretty simple, we get to know the data that was pretty good. Uh, we're going through our normal caravan duties as you could say uh the morning we hear a screaming morning mother of the data ups and we go over there and find out our son has been murdered uh the orc i forget his name zug, right? zug uh who asshole but badass um points me out as the killer points as uh and so then there's a zone of truth that goes down by our paladin and then eventually everybody goes into Zone of Truth and they find out that I have the murder weapon in my bag, but during the Zone of Truth I tell them it's a murder weapon and it's not mine. Hilarious. So yeah. hilarious scene also uh, fits the characteristics of Zone of Truth. And now um, I, the wagons are going to do circles, circle around and uh, keep, you, uh, keep everybody where everybody can be seen. And I have offered myself up to be chained up at night. So, if another murder happens, there's no way I can do it unless they murder me. Very, very true. So, um, we've got uh, three days before this next planned event happened. Um, anybody got anything they want to do? During this time, like I said, you're the caravan. Um, would you carry your sword while you're traveling with the caravan? I oh, do not carry it now. I probably would have gave that to one of my comrades. Okay. Uh, I'll hold on to it. Was Mark behind okay, or hold on to it. Um, that is the only weapon you carry, right? Yep. Okay. Um, would you keep yourself tied to the wagon, much like you did Carlone the Moffel, or how would you guys go about doing this? Um, I think that's appropriate. Anybody keep me tied screen? up. Um, uh, watch at all times. Um, just to prove that I didn't do it. And for safety of others, so. Well, to be fair, you are supposed to be a guard as well. <clears throat> well, I am technically. I didn't think of that, but it's the way to guard him, his caravan for getting raided from all the But, but technically, right now, is she a guard or is she a prisoner? I mean, because oh. this entire time, this will be your next day. I mean, a lot of people are constantly like looking over their shoulder in her direction. If you wish to keep yourself manacled to the thing, I'll keep the key with me because I'm right behind you. Yeah. I Again, I'm not going to hand you your sword in case the stats for the elk. I wish to stay uh, manacled uh, to the back and I'll walk behind the caravan. <coughs> so you're going to be manacled? Mm hmm. You're going to have a rope tied to the caravan mm -hmm. for you? Yep. All right. I assume at this point, Grizzly now needs another guard. Um, you kind of had a free one already. Yeah, actually, that would make a lot more sense. Well, you know, I'll ask if I could fill that position. Um, yeah, in 10 days, he'll pay you the five gold pieces. So, um, yeah, makes a lot of sense that you, he would hire one of you guys as his guard and not her. Puts a little bit more faith into things. Okay, so we got three days. Um, does anybody want to do anything? Uh, just hang out with their Very so you time off. Yeah, you do this. Get to know Austin a bit more. Okay. Austin's brother. Yeah. I That's for a bit. Um, <clears throat> just kind of something I've been doing um, with Grizzly. Uh, you know, have him show me some hunting tips and stuff. We'll go out hunting and then just chill with her. Do you take her hunting with you? Um, if she wants to. Okay, now while you're hanging out with Hillary and you guys, you and Vesper, were training um, or studio, uh, do you quit doing that to hang out with her? <clears throat> Old Hillary, because I mean, you're going from the back of wagon down here to the front, rolling. She has expressed that she doesn't want to do this anymore. Who? Uh, well, I no, 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 no. Yeah, but you started training her also, and she's still doing that because she's uh, sweet talking. She could still join me when I'm doing my daily trainings. 
but you just shove that off then. Uh, I'll still be helping her, yeah, but it's not like an all-day thing when I have free time is when I go to Ed Hillary. Okay, so most of her train's going to drop then. Because you guys are doing that, and now he's doing this. So if you're going to train her, it'd be like probably you, or you and Grizzly. If you're going to train her better with her weapons. I um, can train her with archery. And she's not heavily armored, so she's not fighting. going to be fighting oh. my style oh, anyway. But she's armored. She's pretty well armored. I mean, she's got leather, leather, wouldn't she? Uh, I don't know what she's got. Uh, that would probably be better off with I her. Could her could learning more about how to use it <laughs> dexterously <laughs> instead of... I'm not no, a she's a sword and shield. Yeah. Long sword and shield. I got a rapier. I don't know how mm. great that is. Sword play is sword play. I mean, it just depends on how you do your I mean, what you're using. Yeah, I'll train her. We can train for like an hour a day when we get back. <clears throat> I mean, she can fight. She just can't fight well. Right. We can see if Austin will help, but I'm not okay. so much as friends with him per se. I'm not going to hang out with him from time to time. That's true. Yeah. I mean, I still do a if, daily if sparring if session so she can keep her in. Well, here's the thing, though, when you do these sparring sessions, because in the morning, everybody eats breakfast, they're up and they're going. Yeah. And the only time you've got chance is at night. Well, at night, you're saying you're going to talk to other parent until they forgot this. You guard her as well. So you're going to have to make some decisions she, here. She puts the vines on him, so I can talk to Ed Hiller when she comes over there. You know, maybe she'll stay and chat with me while I'm guarding kind of thing. She's got her own, she's got her own thing to do, too. you got to think about That's that. That's true. She's a merchant. She's not like you guys. She's got people, you know, she's got to watch over her and whatnot. Okay, so I need to make some decisions. You need to make some decisions. You're like, I'm going to do the monk thing. Guarding you is number one priority. If he needs an hour, like his, an hour. Teaching her girlfriend is like second an priority. And if at any point I ever get a chance, like while traveling, is when I'll talk to him. Okay. Well, you can't while you're traveling because now you're guarding. Guard now, damn. Yeah. I can't do that now. Okay, yeah. You're like, horrible, I can be the guard. horrible you multitasker. I'm going to make money. <laughs> You're horrible. Yes. He so, takes my job over for one day. And even if you die, right? Now who's <laughs> stupid? Hey, I never claimed to be smart. <laughs> That's very true. Oh, no. Very very look at his hair. He is as smart as Orin is right. All right, so let's get this straight. Les, you are going to your caravan guard. So for eight hour a day, you stay with the wagon. And your downtime, you guard her. Is this correct? All right. So everything else has to. Sorry about your girlfriend, man. I have more important duties. Oh, I can train her. I mean, just an hour. So, and that's been a while ago, also. So I mean, she's learned some stuff from you in quite a long time. Uh, let's see. Kind of pretty, but you're going back all the way to. It's uh, been almost ten days. So I mean, she's learned some stuff from you. And I've never really been a sword and shield kind of person so it yeah but here's the thing though fighting you train someone to fight is just training somebody to fight like she's learned to guard against somebody that's faster when you train you with you and she's learned how to guard because you've basically got a two-headed weapon yeah. yeah so i mean training's training it's not you're not teaching her style don't fucking run your mouth I can train her by shooting at her with my crossbow. <laughs> dodge. If you can dodge a crossbow, you can dodge. Yeah. Dodge. Um, at night, you're uh, learning some stuff with Varus, magical wise. Um, in these days, I mean, you are still stared at with daggers. Oh, I'm it. Um, Roland, being a guy who has seemed to. Um, put things at peace at times because his own truth has become well known for the end all be all answer for things to a degree even though this last time it's kind of failed um, but still there's someone there that's like hey I've got a way to solve things and then you being there is a different thing um, and out of all of us Rona has seemed the less friendly towards everyone else here True. Um, all the yeah, other the wagons friends. have went to putting one of their own guards with you at night because therefore there's no there can be no foul play going on no uh, you know loose finger bonds or anything like that I agree with this but I also keep an eye on them because what if one of them that's fine but here's the thing you it doesn't matter if you agree or not this is a merchant thing yeah. So, I mean, it, I, yeah, I, wouldn't, really, I wouldn't, wouldn't, even I'm if I disagree, I wouldn't tell them they couldn't do it. I was just, I was um, okay with it. 
But this is what goes on for the next four days, every day. Manacle tied to the wagon. Your chain, they wrap the vines around you. I mean, there might be some times where the merchants will get together and they'll put you on someone else's cart. But Rowan's there and then whatever whatever guard is picked from the merchants will stand guard. Like I said, the next four days are very much on edge. How has Netha, Tarot, and Tamora been? I don't know. Couldn't tell you who that is. There's a ton of people that's what I am. They're all in scars. Let me, uh, go. The ones we made friends with. Let me go look, man, because I have a ton of people on here. And all of a sudden you're just like, hey, how are these people? That's yeah. like six, seven pages back. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Hey, name these people again. Uh, Netha Basin, Taro De Niro, and Tamara. I don't have a last name. But I remember making friends with them when, when we were drinking Garden um, Alden's uh, stuff. Oh, they're in the wagon in front of you. Yeah. And so you've got a long will to do. Huh. I'm like, oh, those guys are in that area spot. So I'm like, I'm just done. friends with all this like, entire wagon. wagon. Yeah, yeah that's, that's, that's not bad. Because <laughs> I'm like, if you, as soon as you said, oh, more of Alden, I'm like, oh, them guys, yeah. See, they're in a totally different yeah. spot. They're in the event section. All right, so we got that out of the way. Um, so tens of them, Elisus, uh, caravan's quiet and whatnot. You set up a camp and uh, of the sort, let's see which caravan has a guy posted with a rolling. June Pole. Who oh, uh, June Pole. Which one is this again? This is a very, very tall guy with an extremely long quarterstaff. Yeah, we're just friends with him. That's where he would leave the gargoyle. No, 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 no. The merchants are posting a different oh, guard from at the night caravan time. at nighttime. Yeah, I forgot. This, yeah, this is at nighttime. Yeah, I'm pretty sure their caravan is safe with the gargoyle yeah. there. Yeah, but well, <laughs> it, it, it's definitely something that catches attention now that you're all formed in circles and staying well, together. Now that we're in a circle and we're the last wagon and the gargoyle is the first wagon, does that mean we're just like right beside his wagon yes. anyways? Um, possibly. Well, look, this is what I'm going to do. Here, everything's crowded together because you're in the woods now. Um... Everybody wrote me a perception hearing. That's not bad. That's not bad. That is 14. 21. 7. 12. I got 15. It was 14 after my bar. All right. Uh, even with Rowan's extremely high perception, he does not beat a 23. Hmm. Not a good thing. Not a good thing at all. Um, you guys are all sitting there, uh, enjoying a little meal and whatnot. Let's see what time this is. Oh, God, no, this is midnight. Um, who takes, question here, since you have the duty with her, how do you guys split up your guard shift now? Because you were the guys that were both on nights, or Vesper, how do you switch this up now? Who takes first watch? Who takes second watch? Well, I imagine. Do you want to take second or want to take first? Because you only need like a four-hour reverie. Well, yeah, I'll probably take first. So. Well, okay. Well, it won't matter because she can also take it last too. Yeah, that's in such a short time. So, oh yeah, that's all. It's both. Uh, at midnight. We can have. We can. I'll start off, and then we'll have like a four. Like while he does four hours of reverie, and then we'll have like a four-hour overlap, and then I'll lay down. That's up to you guys. So that way we have like that four hour gap in the middle where we're both there. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Um, while you guys have fell, um, Roland, uh, you get tired. Because it is, you do have to get some sleep at some time. Um, but like I said, the last couple days have been on edge. Um, no one seems to hear this coming and it makes perfect sense why. Um, you're dead. It's a no, you're not dead. <laughs> you might be. Yeah, though. It's a boulder flying through the air. Yeah, well, chained up, bind up, watch, and various set alarms. It's a alarm it does rain in the sky. I mean, it's probably going to be an alarm to go off when pieces of you go flying out. Yeah. Every yeah. <laughs> a dragon lands right in the middle of the caravan. Everybody, Let's roll me a d20. I need whoever's got the lowest to gets the 14. 16. 16. 6. Last. Okay, so both. So rolling and Ori. I got um, <laughs> rolling. I got a twenty-one. Twenty-one. Okay. Uh, 
20, or that is a 17. That gets you both. Uh, everybody's real quiet, whatnot. All of a sudden, webbing starts getting shot all over everything. You two are webbed. Um, from the woods, you start seeing spiders of all different types of shapes and sizes coming out from the caravans. Roland will immediately start screaming two arms. You don't have to because everybody else is doing it as well. Yeah. Everybody can go ahead and roll me some initiative. It's all sweet. I'm tied up. That uh, much more fun. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, three of us are now tied up. Basically. <laughs> basically, yeah. Good point. Okay, look at what we got. Twenty. 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 Yep. All right, Vesper. A five. All right. Ward. Nineteen. All right, and seven. Going. Uh, Luda, you are manacled in this spell of, you start yelling to arms, to arms, and everybody starts yelling them. You feel the vines slip away from you and they go to the ground. It is oh. your turn. Oh, see here. Um, I will cast, because I'm still manacled up, I will cast Blade Ward on myself, um, and that's where I take half damage. All right. Not much I could do, so. Orin, you are covered in sticky web filament. What does it take to break that? Uh, you need a strength check. I should fireball that you. No, I, I did not. We got so. <laughs> No, that will not do you anything. Roland, your web, any strength check? Uh, strength check, 19 plus uh, 3, 22. You do break free of the webbing. Uh, um, you can take a move action. What about a bonus action? Oh, you can take a bonus action. Bonus, bonus action, down. Shield of Faith, bring my AC up to 19. Okay. And then move action. Uh, These spiders look badass. Looks like... Or it might need my help first, because it's your time to move over here. Okay, so you move over the Ord, uh, single action, you will cut him free. Yep. Vesper, you are free, but you just see strands of webbing, and it's coming from the trees, and it's covering wagons. Um, you see giant spiders the size of ponies. Jeez. You see little spiders and giant groups coming out everywhere. And then you see these large humanoid spiders. And they're running for whatever's carrying the wagons. These two are running for Kurd. For Kurd? Mm -hmm. I can speak as a free action, right? Uh, yeah, sure. I'm going to tell my elf to protect Kurd. Okay. Here's the thing. You don't see this. You're, you're panicking, trying to break free, and your first thought was to run to him. She is the one that's I'm free. I'm going to get the elk in action somehow. Oh, you can yell protect the elk. Protect Kurd, <laughs> Yeah, let her fall or Yeah, that's what I'll do. I have to you know what? Yeah. Or, 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 or it throws a lot of threats because he loses a lot of things. For <laughs> so, Bustier, she is she's beside you. So, okay. I mean, first thing she does is put her back to you. Okay. She's okay. going to defend. Okay, so which one's closest? This closest to me? Yes, that one's closest to me. Oh, yeah, you can't even move closer. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, we'll throw a little miniature out there for her. She looks damaged. They come rushing you from the woods. Okay. Uh, you know what? Since they're right up in my face like that, I guess I'll just go ahead and uh, got a bunch of daggers. Just gonna hit it with my rapier. All right. Pull that out. See what I can do. Fifteen. So twenty. Okay. That is a hit. All right. So. That's uh, four points of damage. Four <laughs> points of damage. <laughs> that more a duelist worth this. Uh, all right. Yeah. Um, it is uh, their turn. The reason we don't fight much uh, to the YouTube world is because we uh, we suck. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's see here. Ward. She's a horde. I tied myself. This swarm comes over Ward. 
this comes with the horrid. Comes to you. you. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> this little swarm gets on the bear. Who's the A? This little swarms, they move over you and they start covering the wagon. Alright, um, or let's go ahead and get you done here on their turn. Um, advantage because you're tied up. A 16 hits you right on the money. Four. Twelve points of damage. Giant spider. An 18. I need a um, I need a constitution save. <coughs> yes. I have advantage because I'm bored. First time you ever got advantage? Fifteen. Fifteen, um, okay. You're taking four points of damage. Giant spider on Bustier. That would be a 15. That should hit her. Or seven. And then Vesper, I missed you with an eight. Luda, chained up. Oh, hold up, I have a spider on you. Yeah. That is a 16, even though I got advantage, we'll reroll four more damage. Throw me a constitution save, take four points of damage. I'll take two damage. Constitution save. Um, I do have a plus four. All your so there we go. Ah! Bye bye. <laughs> uh, seven poison damage. I take all that because it's not physical attack. So. And it is your turn, Luda. Hmm. Blade, oh yeah, blade boots have, have damage. Yeah. Well, it's good for the next yeah. one. Um, I guess we're going to try to um, use a move action first to back away. So we're chained up. What? I thought my hand. No, no. Oh, you're okay. chained up. I'm chained up. When Vines was a release gotcha. from you. All right, well, in that case, I'm going to cast, uh, I'm going to cast Blade Ward again. All and right. uh, I'm going to roll in, in athletics to try to get out, right? Or uh, is it something else? You need to give me a dexterity check to see if you can. Could that be your escape? Okay, so it's plus six. Mm -hmm. uh, that's 12 altogether. Six of the six. Uh, 12 would be enough to get out. Here's the thing for the spell, you need to roll me a concentration. Okay. Um, concentration. Where do we roll for that again? I forgot. It's just your con. Okay. Four. And ten. Yeah, okay. great. I uh, know, your spell fails. <laughs> um, um, or it. Try to break free. Does it get a move action? You're, oh, yeah, hold on. Yeah, she gets a move free. action. I'll take another move action instead of. Uh, uh, you move, it's not as bite you. Can I do an acrobatics to get away? Um, if you can roll me the old school tom the fourteen, because that's how much damage it. Yeah, plus ten. I got a plus, plus, plus twelve in it all together. Uh, seventeen. Uh, yeah, I'll let you move free of the spider. Where uh, are you going? Because you got thick woods all around you. Uh, I'll and the ward has a some target. If you don't care. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Okay. But here's the thing: there's so <laughs> spiders yeah, all over the wagon. But at least I'm up high where I can see. Um. <clears throat> Or you're tied up. Am I still able to cast a spell? Yeah, you can cast a spell. You don't need no concentration. Just so, well, you do because you are being attacked. Yeah, I was just bonus. It was a bonus action spell. Uh, you still don't have to cast it. You still have to go in concentration. You're you're under distress right now. I'll try to break free first. No. Okay. Or six again. Um. I need fourteen. Yeah, six again. Okay. Is fourteen the damage? Beast. I did. I did four damage. Um, Oh, yeah. Ooh, that sucks. Rolling, you're gonna go cutting free. It's an action to cutting free, right? Um, okay, I do that as a bonus. I'll give it to you as a move action. Right, 
I'm gonna cut you free, and then I'm gonna Hallelujah. take a few attacks on. I guess the spider swarm. Is spider there. swarm. All right. First attack is a twenty-two. That will hit. <laughs> Sniggers. Actually, uh, I have a great weapon. Is there a great weapon? Like oh, yeah. I think you were going to roll one of them. I don't think you were going to roll both of them. Can we give a check a little bit? You know, you need to know these things yourself instead of adding like checks. Week, that's why, well, it's that's why I remember. Okay, so so long as it's down the game, you need a book. I do. Badly. I've got it on the computer, but. But I mean, that's them. I just feel like I got it. Uh, yeah. I believe it's ones and twos. I'm not sure. It says you can reroll the die. It doesn't say dies. So I'll get I'll let you get one. You have to what what is the ability? So, it's a great weapon. It says you, if you roll one you can reroll the die. But he's got two dead. I think it actually does work. I'm could be completely wrong though. I don't know. Yeah, it's gonna kind of do it. So we'll, uh, we'll figure it out later. But uh yeah, seven. Seven? That's the first attack. Yeah, that's when your dexterity saves you. Yeah. So do I have to roll? Second okay. attack. No. Fails. Vesper. Alright. I'm going to sheath my sword and cast Burning Hands. Alright. Um, um, how do you figure out what they have to go again? Burn down the forest. Hey. It works, it works. <laughs> so Next so I, don't I need a concentrate. I need a uh, concentration. We need to roll the constitution. Uh, constitution save. You need to be a ten. Three. It's four. No, your spell does not work. Yeah, you're overwhelmed by enormous distraction. You need a ten saving throw to maintain. Varys is kicking ass over there with the spells. Oh yeah, <laughs> I mean, this is going all down the uh, wagon. So you can take a move, but you can't get your spell off. Where's it? 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 Where
I want to take another. I'm trying to think. Should I take another action to cut the weapon again, or should I heal the bear? I don't know if he took damage. Uh, Fuck that shit. I want to enhance the ability on the bear. I'm going to give him additional hit points 2d6 plus 3. That'll work. That is uh, 10 more hit points on team. And he has advantage on strength checks. Or it. So that could be big if he's trying to bust out of the webs, right? Mm -hmm. I'll take my hammer to the swarm. All right. See, I'm not all that bad, guys. Um, 16 plus what that four? Yeah, D8. This is the second time I'm... <laughs> five damage. The bear As a bonus action, I'll... Five. Five. All right. Uh, I still need to do concentration to... For spells, yeah. yeah. You're, oh. I mean, you're in distress. It's not as big as what it was. It's just a tit. It's constitution checks. Yeah, constitution, yeah. So, yes. But if they hit him with whatever else trying to roll. Uh, nat 20. There you go. I put in sanctuary on a curb. You've got to be able to look at It's a touch, is it not? Uh, I thought it was 30 feet. I could be completely wrong. Okay. While well, you're looking at it, I'll put it on myself. Roll it. <coughs> Still got spiders here. Yep. Uh, now I know certain they're out there at curb. Mm hmm. Tell the help. Take okay. her. Uh, 30 feet. Start attacking this yes. uh, spider. That's for one minute. Oh, the swarm, I guess. Uh, mm -hmm. Worst wow. attack. Hey. Is a 21. That's it. It's a twos, right? Mm, well, I think it's ones, is what it said. Okay. Well, three, six, seven, eight points of damage on the first one. All right. The swarm that still swarm up. Swarm is still up. Second attack. 11. Uh, it's a miss. Alright, you taking a move here or anything? Uh, no. Vesper. Alright, pull the back of my rapier back out and going back. We'll swing on it. <clears throat> Alright. 13. 19. That'll hit. Uh, 8 points damage. Alright, you taking a move action or anything? Um, yeah, let me try to, uh, let me go ahead and disengage back this way, maybe. Just gonna leave over this DA. Well, my plan I is just love your life. If I get over here, I can make some range attacks. Well, it's in the thick of the woods, also, and you see a lot of webbing going from these woods. I mean, it's oh, constantly yeah, just showering everything. Okay. Well, I'll probably just stay where I am because I'm not wanting <laughs> to go in there. We need fire. We need <laughs> lots and lots of fire. Okay. They're not a bad, bad idea, but I know it'll work. Um, <laughs> you're going to get swarmed because this guy's on. Okay. This, that swarm's all over the home. That'd be a 21. Yes, sir. Six. I was really low for 44. Six points of damage. Um, okay. Swarm is dead. Fire bites you. Cool for seven, fun. Vesper. For an eleven, a Bustier. Oh, and I can hit nobody. Twelve. Um, let's see. Swarm, swarm, swarm. Your elk. Your elk is webbed. We're going to use that for game purposes. Um, all right. Buddha. Um, you notice that these things have are starting to pull Kurt away, and you see giant strands of web from the woods, and then it's all dragging Kurt away. You kind of look down the line, you see a lot of this going on. Mm, what can I do to help Kurt? I mean, not only just oh. are they pulling the animals out of poor wagons, there's like people that's like trying to fight, like people like run up and cutting their webbing away. It's grizzly gun. Yellow grizzly. He's, he's covered in the wagon. He's covered in swarm and webbed up. I'm going to try to uh, move a, uh, move action, and uh, I'll try to roll athletics and see if I can jump over here, like to get on top of Kurt to make it heavier. Well, you're on top of Kurt already. Oh, I'm on top. Okay. Uh, oh, if I'm on top of him already, I will. Um, um, Fuck. Cut the wedding. I'm going to try to cut the wedding. Good idea. Okay. Well, you did that already once. Um, just roll me damage. It's not hard to okay. do wedding. He's just covered in a lot. I have a weapon. <laughs> you don't have a living. Hey, no. cast burning hands on yeah, him. I got fireball. I got fireball. Oh. And that means gonna hurt Kurt. Yeah, it'll hurt him. I'd rather Kurt get hurt than drug yeah. away by spiders. 
That is a three. Okay. Oh, hold on. It's two of these. Nine. Alright. So so this is actually damage. the first time webbing has been done. Yeah. I totally forgot you have a sword. And then, uh, so that's nine damage if I want, and then my move action. Oh, uh, bonus action, I'm going to cast Bardic Inspiration on Kurt. When he tries to break away, he can roll an extra D8. Okay, so you're not taking a move? Uh, just stay on top of him. Okay, you take one point of fire damage because okay. you're burning this webbing on him. <laughs> he's so, uh, he's like, a flaming bear. Yeah, he does have a bonus of D8 this whenever he's trying to get out of cell. <laughs> this should help him. <laughs> I can't believe I'm trying to get this bear out. I, I'm an animal lover. I'm scored level dirt, I guess. Uh, did my sex story go through the herd? Uh, I don't know. Could you cast it on him? Is that out of range? Feet, yeah. yeah, then it's fine. I will Here's the thing, Kurt's not being attacked. Well, you said we were striking his harness, so I was like, <laughs> No, they're striking his harness. No, no I just transferred me, they were they're trying to take Kurt, so I was trying to protect him. I will backhand swing the hammer onto the big spider and uh, miss wildly as my hammer nearly slips on my hand. That happens. Um, you taking a move or you staying there? Oh, uh, no, I'm not. I don't want to roll it yet. All right. Uh, I'm aware of all of this going yeah. on. You still right in this area? Yep. All right, I'm probably going to provoke an attack. Of our, our okay, team. well, you got, you got all the spires on this wagon, and two all these little bitty ones. They're over here, right? No, this is the wagon. This whole area is nothing but spider swarm. Spider swarm. So if you go through, you're going to get attacks up came from spiders and from the big one. Okay, so I'll stay five feet away so I can... Only take from this one. Can't see the path. This is all trees. This is all legit stuff. I mean, it's all thick through here. This was set up for this. You you play the hero. You gotta take the damage. I'm taking the damage. I'm gonna come up here and use my great sword cut curve for you. Okay. Spider swarm. It's 23. That's it. Yes. Man, these little spider swarms are bad, dude. Let me tell you. I got good con and high AC, so. Um, it's 11. Big spider. That misses you with a six. <laughs> so you go up, you're going to start cutting the webs. Yep. Go ahead and uh, roll me an attack back so I have a higher AC than what I expected. 25. All right. Roll me damage. And one. That's uh, 13 damage. All right, you're cutting him free. Uh, I got two attacks. So do I need? To, is he completely free, or do I need to do? No, no, he's not completely free. You can go ahead. Is the other one? Hey, boss! Wow. Uh, you've shredded the webbing off of him. We'll just call that one. That one. Speak with animals. Is it bonus action too? I don't know. Vesper. Um, it's just it gonna is. I'm gonna to that one again. To All right. To, Help the elk. Uh, 16. Your elk's loved up. 16. That's why I'm telling One you hour to help the elk. With okay. 16. 16 hits. It's action. Uh, okay. Seven points of damage. Seven points of damage. Spider's dead. All right. Now everybody's moving around. These spiders are agitated. I'm going to web you first with that one. That would be another 24. Um, you're webbed. Uh, we're going to web you, because you guys are taking its middle. I miss with a 10. I'm so fancy. Track webbing. Um, web or bustier. She's got a giant one on her. That's a 20. You've killed this spider. They webbed up. Um, we're going to move a swarm onto you. Swarm onto you, Evan. You're up there with a swarm. Yeah, so little swarm on Bustier. No, it's a five. Vesper, that is a 19. We need a Constitution mm -hmm. save. Take four points of damage. <laughs> no, but I don't make that. You didn't make it? Nope. Uh, take 11 poison damage. Swarm on you, Luda. That is a 17. Okay. Nine points of damage. These go back to what have been. Um, I'm unconscious on top of the bear. So you roll off the bear. Uh, these guys go back to webbing up the bear. You see. Um, 
Everybody roll me perception, but Roland, because Roland's already there. Call. Oh, and that twenty. Is it a sight? Yeah. Yeah, nine. Okay. I got a nat twenty, but twenty-three. You you see it? It's not hard. You just both see Luda fall as she falls off curve. Luda. It's not the fire. Well, Luda, we're just rolling for you here. She didn't help the shit out of that bear. <laughs> All right, Orin. I cannot get to her. I will swing down with Dwarven Righteousness into the spider and hopefully not miss again. 14? 14 hits. Jamie, you're worried about damage, you've only got two hit points. Yes. That's uh, exactly my minimum damage. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Are you going to take a move? Okay, let's come up. Now you can move if you need to. I can't get to I her. Up. You can get to me. And you do I'm both. also a ranged character that's been hurt. <laughs> so I'm the healer. <laughs> what do you, I can heal. <laughs> what do you what do you do? Um I, it'll be a waste to move right now, I'll just put myself into more danger. Like where next turn I can move and okay. cut him free or get to Luda. So what do you do? Nothing? Yeah, nothing. Okay. I hope my moves are on the way. Rolling your web, give me a strength check. Hey, you break free. Now you can take a move action. Uh, what about a bonus action? You can take a bonus action. Bonus action, since uh, I can cast it without attacking, just use the bonus action and leave. Okay, well, so here, here's the thing you got to give me a constitution because you're around all these swarms. I'm going to try and thunder smite uh, in this direction. Okay, isn't that when you make an attack? Uh, you gotta make an attack with that. It's, it's a melee attack. It's a bonus action to activate it. Yeah, but if he can't take a melee atta attack with it, 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 holds, it holds on for a minute until he makes an attack. But that's what I'm saying, he can't make an attack. His action was so yeah, for I'm just gonna yeah, prepare yeah. that then. So you're a Cassie, you still gotta roll me a con save. Yeah. That's good, you just need a 10. Alright. Vesper. You do see that Luda has fell. Okay. You got these swarms crawling all over you and her bustier. So she's got this spider that's still up, right? Yeah, she looks pretty weak. Alright, so if I flip this way and fire a magic missile. Got you need concentration. Or, well, since I know my spell fell out last time, try to shoot it with a hand crossbow so I'm not up on it. Yeah, but you're going to swarm, you're going to take disadvantage. Um. Yeah, I should fucking not try it. Try it again. Uh, so. Uh, 11. That is a miss. You gotta take a move action. Um. Say how much damage I took earlier? I don't remember. Oh, with my crossbow, if the first attack misses, I might get the second one. Uh, no, you still, you still get attacked. Oh, so yeah, fire, fire. Yeah. Oh, okay. You still get your attack. Um, hey, yeah, that looks pretty uh, good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because the lowest one's a 17 plus 5. That'll hit it. I was like, yeah, I fucked up on that one. I fucked up. Okay, got it. Uh, 7 points damage on that one. Okay. Snake that while she's adjacent. Oh, is it? Uh -huh. Maybe you are. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Me and Wesley just like, how much damage did I take? Anyway, like, oh, I'm not going to take any damage. <laughs> no, I expect when you get a second, you'll let me know. No. I, uh, did I give you that? Uh, I don't recall ever hearing you say, you said you hit me and then rolled two more You're times dead. and never did any damage. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next character. Uh, okay, <laughs> your turn. Go ahead, Spike. Um. <laughs> Varys starts launching spells at some of these, and they start retreating. He fries a couple of these spiders around. Um, everybody can only visual perceptions. 15, 15, 16. I got 16. You got 16? You just need a 10. 6. I'm <laughs> <Yeah>. blind, remember? <laughs> okay, you notice that... Um, a lot of these caravans, except for the one in front of you and you guys, 
So these caravans are sending their guards out into the woods. Uh, a lot of travelers are trying to help cut free, but you look around, some caravans are missing horses, or some people missing, and a lot of these merchants are like yelling for them to run into the woods and go get their horses and stuff. That's bad, yeah. Um, I'm gonna yell to Roland to see the Luda, and I'm gonna jump up to where um, Grizzly is. So I cut him Grizzly free. Yeah, I pull out my wood carving knife, start cutting him Grizzly gr gr free. So I'm going to uh, fire off my Morgan's heart. All right. Get put life off. So you Are you gonna kill her? I'm gonna, her? I'm gonna give her five points. Five points killing you. Uh, I'm gonna check on our boosty. She's I'm coming up towards the way. Just two hit points. Two hit points. I'll ask Roland if he can look after her. All right. She slips me uh, four. How, how bad? Uh, four hit points. Grizzly's not stupid. Grizzly's not, stupid mm -hmm. Grizzly's not taking any damage. He was really webbed. Um, Roll me a nature check if you want. I mean, anybody, I mean, you're the one that's two checking on here. Plus two, tw fourteen. Um, he's not taking, he's a little burned from her. Okay. She has to smell. But you're thinking just because you're you're used to being in caves, being a dwarf up in mirror bar and whatnot, spiders are trying to get a meal. The bigger the meal, the more bellies it feeds. Yeah. And that's what you're kind of gathering about a lot of these animals, like horses and people being pulled away. Um... If it makes any interest to you guys, the horse from the Day Dove family and the horse beside, behind them where um, Zud Bragg is, their horse got taken away and their guards are in the woods. I heal myself all the way with Mortar's heart and I get up and I to check on Kurt immediately because I don't know if he's done that. You do, he's already checking on him. He's like, oh, you okay? Yeah. I'm, so, I'm yeah. going to ask Grizzly if I should go help the other caravan and look for the horses. Man, he is leaving that up to you. I mean, he's my boss. So he he's, boss. he's leaving that up to you. If you want to help them, you can. But I mean, People have already took it off the woods. I'm leaving that completely up to you guys. Owen will actually speak up. It is stupid to chase these spiders into the woods. But, you know, they may have got a small, small meal. Now you're, you, you know, there people are sending other people out there as a here. Have some more food. I bow off a nest. Probably. Horse right, is gone. But caravan can't move because they can't pull Caravan can't move though. Uh, and people were taken too. Lou's running in the woods. Take off into the woods. Gordos. I'm playing a character. I'm playing like, 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 just like grab my crossbow. I'm playing a character. I'm gonna stop you for dinner. Off in the woods. Yes. I'm gonna tell where Boosty is and stay here. I'm playing a character. Like, like, damn, that's what I would do. She will not let you leave on your own. And she follows with you. Okay. With with two hit points. Um. You learn. No, she's belly burst that out over right now. I know that she's really beat up. Healed up as. Hurt. Yeah, I got healed though. I have noticed. Oh, yeah, you did. Roustier is really in bad shape. That yes, she is in pretty bad, bad yeah. shape. I walk over and uh, I'll drop her 15 points from the way out of hands. Okay, that all of us actually heal, heal her up. She's got 22. That leaves me with five just in case somebody falls. I can. What about you, Ward? I look to Vera's go, I can't let her die alone. And I chase after Luna. Uh, no, but you haven't healed yeah. yourself up at all. I want to do 15. Okay. I, I can cast your ones. Yeah, that's what I'm just saying. I've, I've never played a character this much. This is exactly what you would do. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's fine. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is, is it? I found all the horses and people got to it. I'm also yelling, Luna, get your bloody knife! <laughs> yeah, he had no weapon. <laughs> like I'm yelling at him. I just want to get your murder weapon. Give it to me, murder weapon. Like, I'm like swinging your scimitar over my head. I do hear him. If I do, and I turn around and I run and get the blade, he I tell him I'm him. sorry, I gotta do what's right. And I continue to go into look for these horses and. Walk five, five feet slower! Rolling, <laughs> you going with him? Rolling kind of sighs real deeply. Says, May Torn protect us. He gets on his elk, and yes, he'll follow. <laughs> Cool. Uh, Another was, big meal for these fighters. Yeah, is, uh, I was trying to express so the dumb, bears to kind of help with the grizzly yeah, yeah, herd. Yeah. Roland, as a good person, cannot let his friends run off in the woods to die alone. Yeah, I'm that's why, yeah. Uh, if grizzly would have been like, no, you don't have to, I wouldn't have, and then Luda just fucking takes off. It's like, God, God damn it. <laughs> I'm like, are your horses missing? 
Well, we can't pull the curb on him. Now somebody's gonna die out here. It's gonna be his fault. All right. So be. we're gonna sacrifice him. <laughs> now he's so. throwing me a blade. That's why he's over there. Did you get on him? It's not hard to catch up with anybody at Trey because people's got torches and whatnot. You can see, um, I mean, because eventually you guys are going to have to swing over once you run because everything's good in y'all's chip. Uh, can we find Zug? That well, but, but like I said, that some of, a lot of these people that took off together are meeting up because some of them got torches and whatnot. But yeah, I'll you find, can meet up with I'll, them. I'll find Zug and I'll just tell him, you know, I wish I'm here to help you and find your horses. Um, he just snorts at you and just keeps going. Man, what happens? He, he, yeah, he's he's a prick, dude. Zerg does not want my help, and I will help him find his horses. Okay, yeah, because this is all speak so with weird. animals. Can I hear these spiders? They're insects, they're not animals. Insects. Uh, I thought they kind of boost, though. No, nope. I, don't, I'm there, I don't know how this works, but no, I'm going to stay so because, because animals, insects are mindless. Ta-da. See, what I would have done was, like, how, how he just starts hearing that. I'm going to eat you. No, that's what you hear would be drumming. Yeah, so, because insects are mindless. The whole idea was it would help me get Lord of the Rings were... Uh, understand guys, where they're at, where they're coming from. Oh, you can really sell with you. You was still have to be alone to begin with. Yeah. Yeah. So, That's what I'm, I think I ran so you guys thing. running after everybody else to go rescue some people, right? Rescue some horses off into the spider woods. 